Hello and welcome. This time we want to limit our outputs. Okay. Let's imagine we have now 42 students. Yeah? Let's imagine I want to get I want to see who's the oldest one. Who are the five oldest ones? Yeah? Well, we know the command for this. We know this. Yeah? So we are simply using a select statement. Select, and we want to have the student forename, yeah? and I want to I want to write forename. Then we want to read the student surname that I know who's the oldest, yeah, as surname, and then we also want to see when it, he or she is born. Student born as born. Yeah. Now from from student list yeah. past uh, and of course order by student born as Janine. student born as Sianden. Let's look. Working. Yeah. Getting a list of all students in order of their date of born, the born date, the birthday. If I'm only interested in the top five, let's say, yeah, the five oldest persons in my school, yeah, I'm not interested in the whole list. Yeah. Here with 42 entries, it's still okay, I can scroll up. Yeah. If there are hundreds of entries, poof, then I do not want to scroll up until I see those. Yeah. I'm using the same, the same request, yeah. just adding in the end limit 5, and I only get 5, the top 5 results. And the rest is not inside my result set. Yeah? So this limit is limiting the output. Be aware of this limit is not working on all SQL databases. Yeah? In the Microsoft SQL Server, for instance, it's called top. And MariaDB and MySQL it's working. Okay? So it's not always there. Yeah? Limit. If I do not want to see the oldest one, but the five youngest ones, do you see? Junge Hüpfer is the youngest one. And the Peter Schowski hands, of course. Ah, young guy. Huh? Yeah, limit close. Ah, I promised. Easy, right? Go. I think. There is a lot of more in SQL, a lot of more things, yeah, using wildcards and so on. Uh, for us, it should be enough. Yeah? We were snooping inside the SQL statements. We understand now how relational database is working, how we can get some data in and out. We can do those rather, we have to admit, these are still simple requests. Yeah? SQL is much more. Like I said, for us, here at this point, I would say it's enough. Yeah. Uh, I'm still going to show you another possibility of entering SQL commands, a little bit more graphic one, yeah. but this then will be in the next video. For this time, thank you very much for listening and goodbye.